Alright, I'm going to show you guys how to set up the Adobe Air 3 beta in your existing Flash Builder and Flex SDK. Uh, the first thing you need to do is download it from labs.adobe.com. Uh, you'll hit the download here and there's two downloads for your platform. You'll need the runtime, which is this, and then the SDK so that you can use it in your projects. So download both of those and then go into your applications folder same on Windows program files wherever they put it nowadays but uh, open up Flash Builder 4.5 and then there will be an SDKs folder and you'll have all these versions of the SDK I already copied it but you'll want your latest one which is 4.5.1 and make a copy of it in this folder and that's what I did here so it's just a copy of it right now. Uh, let's go ahead and change this to 4.5.1 and then I'll just call it um, Air 3 Beta. Right. I'm going to go ahead and delete this. Okay, so now that we have that, go ahead and open that up and get your Air SDK, the Air 3 SDK and go ahead and copy it in your flex folder just as tarball here and then we'll need to jump into terminal and cd into uh, your flash builder 4.5 uh, sdk folder so let me get this Come on. Oh, it's Adobe. All right, and then it's SDKs, and then we want four dot five dot one Air three beta. All right, so now that we're in here we will need to call tar jxvf to tell it it's a tar bz2 and then uh, whatever the name of it is air3 this and just hit enter this will extract it straight in to this folder uh, if you try to extract it with a, another application it won't work you'll get an error and while this is doing this, I'm going to launch Flash Builder. Alright, so now it's extracted that. Let's uh, remove that tarball file. Okay. And now that we're in Flash Builder. Let me move this around for you. Uh, we'll want to hit go into our preferences and then um, go into Flash Builder and then installed Flex SDKs. Let me go ahead and remove that one. I'm not using it. Uh, you'll hit add, find its location. And Right, Air 3 Beta, hit open. It'll come up with that. I'm just going to put in Air 3 Beta here to name it. Hit OK. And we have that. Uh, you can check it if you want it to be the default. But let's hit Apply and OK. And now if you want to use Air 3 in your project, you'll go up to your Project's Properties. Hit Properties, Project properties and then you want to go to um, flex build path and uh, maybe it's flex compiler yeah it's right here with additional requirements just put this on a new line you will want swift um, version and then what it equals and for air 3 it's 13 and you'll just hit OK and apply You'll want to use a specific SDK, change our Air 3 beta, hit 
hit apply and then that will uh, move it to the uh, air 3 I don't I think you'll have to uh, you'll hit OK then go into the descriptor and um, we'll need to change that yeah see it's giving us an error in our descriptor if we look at it it'll probably say something about version number yeah 2.6 we change this to 3.0 now save that and that gets rid of our errors and now we have Adobe Air 3.0 beta in our flex projects.